So the third thing here we want to we want to present here is about our special angles. All right. So in nowadays you don't need to memorize this isosceles triangle, right angle triangle. You don't need to remember this already because you can press your calculator. Your calculator can perform insert three over two. Okay. In old old days. Our calculator just MS570, they cannot perform search 3, will come up decimal, right? Uh, so, siapa yang, siapa yang calculator baru, bukan yang hitam tu, yang boleh baca search. So, sebenarnya, technology already help us to overcome our memorized problem. So, kita guna technology yang sedia ada. Boleh? Tak payah dah susah. Ni zaman saya. Sama saya tak ada calculator yang boleh tunjuk setiga. So saya kena ingat special angle adalah 30 tajah, 60 tajah, lagi 45 tajah. Then saya kena ingat length dia supaya kita boleh baca sine, cos, tangent dalam bentuk macam ini, dalam bentuk sebutan set. Ha, maka kena ingatlah satu table ini. So nowadays, not, not relevant to you already because you are new generation with new technology. Technology already help you to learn better. Alright? Alright? So, but what we need to concern here is, you must know, in the special angle, we can call it special angle, is 30 degree, 45 degree, 60 degree. So these three, these three uh, special angle, you come out in cert form. Kamu punya value akan dalam bentuk cert, dia takkan dalam bentuk decimal. Okay, so selain daripada special angle, 30 tajah, 60 tajah, dengan 45 tajah, ah, so kita boleh ulang balik topik 5, ni belajar trigonometry function. So in some kind of the angle, you have special value, where you with Revise back when you're having a sign when you're having a sign graph. What's your graph? So you know, so does start with zero up to one and then come back to negative one and end with zero, right? Right? So here is 361 round, one period. Then here is 180, right? Then here is 0, right? Maximum value occur at 90 degree. Minimum value occur at 270 degree. The value here is 0 and 1 and negative 1. So this is all your value. So beside, beside this, so actually this table is not complete yet. Beside 30, 45, 60 that getting from triangle, the special angle getting from triangle, Actually, we have a, the value, the special value you can see is when 0 it is value of 0, when 90 degree it is 1. So, when it is 180 degree it is, it is 0, when 270 it is negative 1, when you have 360 it is 0. So this angle, you're having a special value. So from so kalau dari pada graph kosong kosong ninety degree one hundred eighty two hundred seventy and thirty. So you can cut, you can see its value zero one zero negative one zero. So Daripada segi tiga, tiga puluh, empat puluh lima, enam puluh lima, enam puluh, sebutan value kamu dalam bentuk set. Okay, so value dia agak special, dia takkan jadi decimal. So, selain daripada tu, you punya value akan decimal. So, kalau kita tengok cos pula macam mana. So, in my part here. Dalam lecture part saya, saya tak tersempat guna bahagian sini sebab bahagian ini akan diguna di 7.3 solution part. Hmm. So mungkin kamu akan rasa 
are the you have starting point but you don't know what is the point of using this nanti kamu sambung dekat tutorial tengok lecture ada guna benda ni tak faham ke ha so kamu akan learn, agak, kamu belajar sekerat dengan saya lagi sekerat tu kena sambung dengan pencara tutorial Okay, so kalau cos, cos, it graph will start with 1, then go down to negative 1, then up to 1 back. So this is 1 period. So means that 0 is 90 degree and 270. So from here you can see uh, cos, start with angle 0, 1. Go to 90 degree, it is value 0. Go down for 180, value is negative 1. Come back, 0, and then ending at 361. Okay. So for... The last trigonometry tangent... Tangent, you won't have any maximum or minimum value because the graph will be going up together with its asymptote, right? And then come to 90 degree, the pattern will be repeat. So the period of tangent, it will be occur at 180 only. Uh, the period of the, you know one period, you learn physics, right? One period means the graph satu round saja. So bila dia repeat tu kira dia period yang kedua betul? Uh, so one period only only occur at 180. So when you come to 360, actually your tangent is having your uh, graph in two period. Okay. So dari pada sini kita boleh ingat ah uh, angle untuk tangent kosong kosong. Tetapi untuk 90 degree, it will be undefined because this is the place of your asymptote. Asymptote adalah tempat yang tak ada graph. Uh, so, this is undefined. So, when you come to 180, the value is 0. When you go to 270, it is undefined. Then, when you end up with 360, the value is 0. Uh, so, all of these are our special angles. Uh. Special angle come from triangle and special angle come from graph. That will give you special value here in the form of cert in the or in the form of maximum or minimum value. Alright. Alright. So actually not difficult for you to memorize because this one you can use calculator. The value of this you can. Remember the image of graph, right? Sine, cos, tangent graph. So you can notice that we don't have any cosecond, don't have any second or any cotangent because cosecond, cotangent, and second, the trigonometry is derived from our three basic trigonometry here, right? Right? Uh, so like just like when we want like cosecond, let's say 30. Uh, why in the table we don't have? Because cos second is derived from 1 over sine. So that's why all the special angle involving the trigonometry, just the three basic trigonometry functions only. Okay, cos second can derive from sine, second can derive from cos, cotangent can derive from tangent. 